It is a case that has divided a community. St sides split over whether an Air Force veteran who took down and tore apart a Mexican flag acted out of patriotism or hatred. A jury spent two days hearing the case of that man, Peter Lynch. Shelton Dodson is live at district court with his punishment. Shelton. Well, when it boils right down to it, this is just a misdemeanor case of criminal damage to property. But then you factor in the racial overtones. And in all likelihood, this is a case that will be remembered a lot longer than any sentence that Peter Lynch could have received. When Peter Lynch tore apart a Mexican flag that had been flying improperly on the UNM campus, he touched off a firestorm of emotions. The reading of the verdict against him this afternoon was much more subdued. We find the defendant guilty of criminal damage to property. During the course of the two-day trial, Lynch's attorney argued the U.S. Air Force veteran was only defending federal law by removing the Mexican flag, which should have been accompanied by an American flag, a point Lynch reiterated in a brief post-sentencing interview. I was a Cub Scout. You know, I learned when I was seven years old how to raise and lower a flag and fold it. If a seven-year-old can learn it, you know, I, I think it's kind of embedded into our society as Americans. and. I just, I, I feel strongly about the, the colors of the United States of America, and that's, that's, what, that's what it's all about. Lynch faced a maximum of six months in jail and a $500 fine. But instead, Metro Court Judge Clyde DeMerciman gave him a six-month deferred sentence, placed him on probation, and ordered him to replace the flag and complete 48 hours of community service. The judge added that evidence that Lynch's actions were fueled by racial hatred were not proved. There's been no evidence presented at trial which disputed that defendant acted out of his own sense of patriotism. However, the jury found that destroying somebody else's flag is illegal, whether it's backed by patriotism or something else. Now, Peter Lynch has already replaced the flag that he destroyed, but he did it as parts that were issued by UNM, not just the court order today. The university said he had to do that in order to remain a student there. Live at District Court, Shelton Dotson, Eyewitness News 4.